Hello all, it's Than from Tidal Gardens. So the other day I picked up an absolutely incredible fungia plate coral and I figured well why not make a quick video and show it off a little bit. Before I get into that, let's talk a little bit about these guys. They come in a wide assortment of colors. They're usually green, but if you're lucky you can run into some of the more uncommon colors. One of the unique things about plate corals is that they're one of the very few corals I know of that can move around on their own. It's for this reason that I recommend keeping them on the substrate, because they're really good at jumping off your aquascape and landing on something else. As you know, I like to feed corals when possible, and feeding plate corals is very easy. They have a central mouth, and whatever lands on the coral gets ferried to the center and swallowed. Like most large polyp stony corals, they can eat large chunky food like mysis and krill. I try to stay away from brine shrimp because they have practically no nutritional value. Okay, as promised, I want to show you guys a really cool color variant. This fungia plate has a red base, which is pretty rare in its own right, but the tentacles are speckled blue. It's literally the first one of this type I've ever seen, and I've seen thousands. Now, there's probably more um, vibrant colors that are possible out there, but this combination of color and pattern is out of this world. Just for fun, I'll end the video showing it feeding. Okay, it looks like he's all done, so we're all done. Thanks again for watching, and take a look at our website, tidalgardens.com, for this and other rare corals.